بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ویلکم گائز ٹو مائی اندر ویڈیو سیریز آن اینڈرائڈ ایپ ڈیولپمنٹ سو گائز ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول ٹیچ یو ہاؤ ٹو یوز دی گوگل میپس پلیسز اے پی آئی اینڈ ان دس ویڈیو وی ول ڈسپلے دی نیئر بائی پلیسز آل رائٹ فار ایگزامپل نیئر بائی ہوٹلس اور نیئر بائی اسکول اور ریسٹورینٹس آل رائٹ سو آئی ول ٹیچ یو ان اے ویری سمپل وے okay i have seen many videos where they uh, the coding is very complex okay so i will make it simple and you will understand it easily okay so let's get started so first of all as you guys can see i have the google maps activity okay so here we have google maps api dot xml so here i am using my api Google Maps API you can generate your own API from here okay uh, Google Maps API okay so when you open the Google developers page so here you can select Android and from there you can get your uh, API key okay here Google places API for Android and Google Maps Android API okay so in this video uh, this uh, video series will contain two or three videos all right so in this part i will be showing you how to first of all display the user recurrent location okay and in my next video i will show you how to uh, how to uh, find the nearby places okay so let's get started so first of all uh, as you guys can see i have this api uh, key so you have to just paste it here okay so now your uh, integration google maps integration is done after that what you can do you have to go to your build or gradle file and in here you can see you will be able to see this one uh, android.gms.playservicesmaps and what you need to to invert what you need to do you need to copy that okay and just uh, paste it again and change the maps to location okay so you have two dependencies here maps and location all, all right so after that you guys can see these are the these are the code which the android studio has already generated okay so now what we can do here first of all let's say okay so here we will display the current uh, the user current location so for that what we can do is first of all we need to implement the method first of all we need location listener and don't forget to uh, implement this one com dot google dot android dot gms okay don't select this android dot location it will cause an error so location listener all right so it will say that you have to implement the method on location change so we can say on location change all right so now what we can do here we can also say google api client dot or connection callback okay and we also need google api client dot uh, on connection field <laughs> listener and now here what we need to do to need to do is we need to implement the method on created so we can say on connected on connection suspended on connection field all right so now we have these uh, these um, methods all right so now what we can do first of all we need to initialize the google map uh, google api client okay so we will connect our uh, google api client so what we can do is we can say google api client client and so here in our own map ready method what we can do we can say client equals to new google api client dot builder and we can pass this all right okay so guys what uh, we can do from here uh, we, it is saying an error but equals to new google api client dot add api and here we can say location services dot api all right and we can also uh, we need to add a connection callback so add 
connection call back pass this reference and add connection field listener and we have to pass this reference and finally we need to build it okay so now all the errors are gone and finally we need to connect the client okay so now the client is connected all right so uh, what we need to do is we need to request for location all right so we can say location request we can create an object of loca uh, location request and in our on connected method all right so when it and the client will connect so on connected the on connected method will be called so what we can do here we can say request equals to new location request all right and we can say dot create all right so we can uh, define some okay so we are getting an error here new location request So why I am getting this error? Let me see the code. Why it is uh, having some error we are going let's see the project which i created so we can say okay so we need to copy that and we just need to paste it okay so now we need to define some parameters so we say request dot set interval uh, after what time we need to request the, the location okay so 1000 means one second and we also say request dot set priority so we need to define the priority so we can say location request dot priority priority high accuracy all right and finally we need to uh, request for the location so we can say location services dot fused location api dot request location updates and in here first of all we need to pass uh, client and we need to pass request and finally we need to pass this reference okay so it's giving me some error because so what we can do create a press alt enter and you need to add the permission check here okay so now all the others are gone so we have requested for the location through the location request uh, class so now what we need to do it's now very simple so we just need to go to our own location change method and here we uh, will receive the request the location um, i mean uh, latitude and longitude so we can say if location is equal to null so we can display the user that it could not display uh, it could not find the location so we can say location not found and in else part what we can do we can say let long uh, current okay let long current equals to new let long and in here we can say location dot get latitude and location dot get longitude all right so here what we can do camera update update equals to camera update factory dot new let long zoom in here we can pass our let long and we need to pass the zoom parameter okay so what we can do m map dot move camera or we can say animate camera and in here we will pass the update and also we need to add add the marker so what how can we add the marker so we can say m map 
okay so we first of all need to write marker options first we'll new marker options and we can define op options dot position and in our position method what we can pass let long current also we need to pass options dot title current location and we can also say options dot okay so these two are uh, enough so we can say mmap dot add marker and in here we will pass options here all right so guys uh, let's run the code so let me open mirror go uh, software so let me connect my smartphone So we have connected our smartphone and I will click on OK. Let's see if it works or not. It's very easy. Google Maps API is a bit very easy for me at least. So uh, I hope you have also learned something from this tutorial. So guys now our application is running and as you guys can see we are displaying the user current location okay so uh, in my next video i will show you how to find the, the nearby places using the google maps places api all right so if you like the video please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you goodbye